That's a good stupid, huh? <laughs> good morning, friends. My name is Brandon Dayton. I'm your humble narrator. Welcome back to Project Zomboid. We've uh, got some more errands to do today. It's early in the morning yet, but that's just fine. We're gonna figure things out as we tend to do. Actually, I could just climb through this thing. I keep forgetting I installed these. Hmm. It's quite useful, yes. I think I wanna build across there, and I'm also going to try and finish the furniture shop today. And uh, lastly, I want to fill up this final gas can that I have before the power goes out, which uh, I'm sure is due to happen just about any time now. First, I should put down these fucking doorknobs. That was so dumb to go out the window. <sighs> ah, I just wanted to feel cool. Can't you understand? That's all right. <clears throat> I'll put some uh, some doorknobs and things up. Canned soup can come with me. That's a delicious treat. <laughs> I'll put these doorknobs down, I'll grab the axe, because we'll need it at some point. And, uh, yeah, I've got my baseball bat. My reliable, lovely, wonderful, zombie-beating baseball bat. Uh, I still think our foot is broken. It's, it's taken so long to heal. Really, if you, uh, keep yourself well-fed, that'll help. That bitch is still knocking her head against the door. <laughs> it's so sad. <sighs> You could just go out the window. She's like a goldfish or something. Anyways, we're uh, headed down the main strip here, which probably is going to be a really dangerous thing. Uh, yep. Hi, zombie lady. Can you just lay down? Lay down. Go ahead. It's fine. Good. That's a good stupid, huh? <laughs> and, uh, yeah. Here's the gas station. Pass right by it, <laughs> of course. Got a little lost a uh, couple episodes back, but that's fine. We're here now. And it says I have a fairly heavy load. Although I've just started. Gas can is now full. Toss that in the bag. Wonderfully done. That is one mission for the day completed. I think I can fit... um another log in that doctor bag still but we'll use some that are a little bit closer to base I got plenty of nails I'm sure yeah 51 that'll do and uh, I'll try and patch up the the furniture shop coming up on the police station good old police station there's a lot of landmarks here I think yeah this is this is probably a good place to have a base Especially since I'll be walking through here relatively often and uh, clearing it out of the zombie scourge. Which seem to reinfest like every single night. Yeah, they've broken all the windows on the police station. I'm sure that's a, a very dangerous place to go at the moment. I could go over there, <laughs> but I won't. But I ain't gonna. Uh, let's have a little bacon. Eat some of this bacon. Get this axe out. Chop down another tree. There we go. Excellent work. He's a lumberjack, and he's okay. Can equip that primary. A few more logs to get up here. Oh yeah. And I'm feeling it in my back. I brought a little too much shit with me. And that's okay. Eat the rest of this. Painkillers? Are painkillers gonna help you? If we put the axe away? Nope. Nope. Well, sorry. Sorry it had to be this way. This looks uh, pretty boarded up. I think we did a pretty nice job here. Oh. And we had to stop there. Okay. So get them logs out. Saw them up. <clears throat> and I think those two windows down there are broken. That ain't no good. Oh man, extremely heavy load. Do not move. Good. 
Gonna keep this furniture shop locked down. Secondary section of the base, should we end up needing it. And uh, I think we might <laughs> at some point. Go ahead and barricade that over there. Move very slowly. Please don't break back. Mm hmm. Oh, we can level up that guard. Or blade maintenance. Mmm. That might be good for the axe. But I also don't want to get bitten. Mmm. I'll use it for the axe. That's fine. There is no wrong answer. I will get enough skill points to do even more. Even more wonderful things. There we go. Barricade that up all nice. I've still got a heavy load. I don't understand. Oh, because doctor's bag needs to go secondary. Duh! Sprinting is leveling up really, really nicely. Maybe running all around the map is not the uh, correct way to play Project Zomboid. I don't know. There's really no correct way to play it, but... There's my theory. Can, can I chop this, please? Would you? Would you? Could you? Thank you so much. There's a good boy. He's a good boy. Load myself up a little more. Get ready to apply. Apply all of my logs. Yeah, I really like the, uh, the ability to just basically take over a town if you've got the manpower to do it. Really, at the moment, yeah, with just me here, I feel a bit outnumbered. A bit taken aback at all of the the work that I have to do. Hence why I have not watered the plants. I would like to find a fucking watering can too. Damn it. That is uh, one thing that we definitely need to put on the list. A watering can. This should be able to cover up a few more windows at least. Saw him up. Saw him up. There you go, boy. Yeah. I get really nervous with that threatened back injury shit. <sighs> as long as we don't move too much, I think it's, uh, okay. Is that the right thing to assume? It's kind of weird that I need to equip the, uh, the plank and the hammer, so I unequip my doctor's bag. I don't like that none too much. Can I barricade that more? I guess not. Fine. Well enough. Yeah, we'll need three more planks, which I think I might even have inside the house. So, uh, we can finish this up in no time at all. No time at all. And I also got some sheets so I can cover up those doors. Because you never know when the horde's gonna come a-callin'. And, uh, this might be the place that I have to duck into. I'd like to get back to the main, the main base, but, uh... It might not happen always, necessarily. So there we go. Doctor's bag. Equip primary. Mm-hmm. Wonderfully done. We're just a little bit exerted, but no problem. No harm, no foul. Uh, let's unpack a couple of these. Boop, 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 boop. One and two. And close curtains, and close curtains. Excellent. So we just need to finish up that one over there with two more planks. I don't think there's any way that they can see through, uh, yeah, this right here. I will add one more sheet to this door, just because that's kind of lulzy. If I do end up in that room, we're probably fucking dead anyways, but... <laughs> I like to think it might help. NPK fertilizer I probably should have used before I planted all that shit. But, uh, no matter. We're done with that for now. Definitely liking how, uh, how things are coming together. I'll have to work just a little more. Get these, uh, these planks. I just need two. Give me two of these. 
Thank you so much. I'll go finish up that building. ASAP. I could also build some, uh, some more doors and whatnot. Which I'm sure I will get to eventually. Unpack. Hold these planks out. Put it in that lady's mouth. Pull these planks out. I only have one. Oh, no, wait, I have two. Oh, my God, I have two! <laughs> there we go, barricade one. Keep unpacking. Why did you stop unpacking? It doesn't make sense. He just had, like, a, another thought pop in his head because I put it there. Because I am his lord and master? Wah, 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 wah. All right, we're looking good. I'm still wearing a skirt. That's how I know I'm looking good. <laughs> Let's see, there's lots of branches and shit down here. But logs, that's what I like the most. Fucking logs, bro. I probably shouldn't kill all the trees. Do they grow back? Is there like a, a respawn cycle to the trees? I guess that would be a safe thing to assume. There we go. Four more logs, just like that. Load them up. Load them out! Ah. Oh. It's just so good when you're able to make progress. Such a nice thing. <laughs> there was a, a long time with this game where I could not figure out what I was doing for the life of me. I just uh, was stumbling and bumbling and then somewhere around like 20 or 30 hours in, things started clicking just a little bit. It might also been because the uh, interface was sweetened up and shit like that too. But all of a sudden I knew what I was uh, doing. And it was a great feeling. <laughs> I remember that. I was like, oh my god. I can actually play Project Zomboid and kind of win halfway-ish. Going to uh, build another door here. Make an airlock. Mm-hmm. I think that's the thing to do. That that seems solid, right? Maybe. Um, let's make a door frame. There you are. Looking good. And now I need my uh my whatnots. What do you call them? Doorknobs? Door hinges? Etc. And we'll have uh, even even another part of the base completed. Dude, this is super low key. I don't think anybody's going to be able to find this. If they do, they're probably going to end up coming up, uh, from the other side. Which is just fine with me. Did I put planks in here? Yeah, I did. Wonderful! Wondrous well! So that's enough planks to build the door. I just need two hinges and a door nub. There we go. And grab one. Nicely done. I really like how, how this thing comes together. I'm amazed by you, Project Zomboid. I probably want to build another wall uh, along the south there. It might be a smart idea. Let's unpack all this shit. Not that. That's the wrong thing. You unpacked the wrong thing. Put the knife back in the bag. Get in the flask. <laughs> it's from Little Nicky. Everybody seemed to hate that Adam Sandler movie, but for some reason it really uh, tickled my friends and I pink when we were younger. Get in the flask. <laughs> I can just remember saying that to my friends a lot, to the point where it's probably annoying to an adult. But looking back, man, those were fun times. I tell you what, another door, another dollar. Oh shit, we can't make door? Yes, we can. I need to walk away a little. Yeah. Fine, whatever. I made the airlock kind of a uh, crisscross, so if you leave one door open, you can't necessarily see the other door, which seems like a good idea in my head, in theory. 
but I ain't a hundred percent sure. Let's uh let's do some cooking now. I feel like making some sandwiches. We've been working hard today. Doing all the things. Do we have uh some 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 bread? Some bread somewhere? There it is. Slice that up. Wonderfully done. That's right. Now what else do we need? We can make a burger. Mmm, burger. Let's make an animal meat burger. That's gonna be real good. We'll make another one because we have the animal meat to do so. Mm-hmm. And our third burger should be, uh... Bacon burger? Mutton chop burger. Mutton burger. Oh yeah. That's nice. We'll put some onions, some lettuce, some pickles. Oh yeah. It's gonna be good. I'll cook the shit out of this thing. I'll put some mutton on the uh, animal burgers as well. Keep it all nice and fresh. Let's do uh, mustard. Ooh, mushroom. Portobello mushroom. What a treat. Some corn on the other one. Yeah, I don't even know what I'm doing anymore. I just kind of, uh, <laughs> mashing a bunch of shit together. Mustard as a spice. Oh, yeah, we'll put some mustard on this one as well. Good. So, uh, I think we did that up relatively well. I will need to cook these burgers because they've got animal meats, assorted animal meats inside of them. And did I keep the uh, mutton chop? Did I use it all up? I guess I used it all up in the burgers. Here you go, burgers. Load them up. Get cooking. Ah, and that uh, exertion should go away as I am cooking the burgers. Everybody likes a good burger, don't they? Yep, just in time. Getting a little peckish. And I need to keep myself well fed in order to uh, get my foot healed. My fucking foot! It's still broken! And I hate it. But it's okay. It's gonna be healed uh, one of these days and I'll, I'll feel that it's such a miracle. And I'll have learned a hard lesson. Never, ever, 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 ever jump out the window. Ever. Ever. Do you understand? We eat half this burger. Mmm. Half that burger was enough to put me, uh, to very well fed. Nicely done. Nicely done! I'm torn between, uh, knocking down more doors. We do need to knock down some more doors, I think. That'll be just fine. A little bit of weight. A little bit of extra weight. Put that axe away. Let's go do some thing. It is raining, but it's not gonna take us very long to traverse to the office building. These poor cabbages. My cabbages! <laughs> Uh, maybe I should do this door. It's like right on the bottom. Maybe I should climb up a little bit. I don't really want to get in a fight with a zombie, especially with uh, a sludge hammer equipped. That doesn't seem like a winning move. Ah! Mmm. Too full to eat this. You can eat some jerky, can't ya? You can eat some of that, can't ya? A little more. Mmm. Like that. We don't have to drink the sodas and shit yet. Oh yeah, eat that ham. Super fucking healing boost. Ultimate healing boost. So I don't have to eat my burgers immediately. Hambaga. Chibaga. Hmm. I guess I'll break this door. Seems like a winner. Seems like a winner. One, two, three, four, five. We're alerting some zombies. Six, seven. And that is enough.
to make another door. Thank you so much. Oh, my fucking exertion is through the roof. I had better not meet any zombies, or, uh, it will soon be over for me. I'll come back and pick that second door off. <clears throat> I don't think I really want to add this as, like, part of the base. I just wanted to wall it off. For safety's sake. We've done some good building already. But, uh, yeah, there's definitely more to be done. I make no qualms about that. Hmm, walking so slow, super exhausted. Now I'm in the rain. That's foul. It's just foul, and I'm in the rain. I don't like it. I don't trust it. Could catch a cold, you know? Jeez. Where did I, did I uh, put my BB gun? Should I read uh, Trapping for Beginners? That'll be a good thing. That'll get our mind off of our exhaustion. Go ahead, give that a read. While you stand in the tool cupboard, you fucking weirdo. <laughs> well, I did a bit of reading. My uh, exhaustion has barely gone away at all. So uh, I think I think it's just time to go to bed. Maybe call it. Getting a little bored. Fairly heavy load. Blah, blah. Blah. <laughs> oh, this gas can. I need to get rid of that. That's probably weighing me down considerably. There we go. Get them planks out of there. Again, a little peckish. Yeah, my guy's not in great shape at the moment. Not in the best shape. We're gonna get this fella up to bed. We're gonna get this little guy in, in bed. Oh, that's that's not the the way. See, he's so exhausted he doesn't even know the own the way through his own house. Well, it's not technically his house; it's just a restaurant that he decided to stay in forever. But that's okay. We understand him. Get rid of my moodle. Oh yes, very well fed. Hmm. I just need a little sleep, and I'll feel so much better, friends. This has been Project Zomboid. I have been Brandon Dayton, your humble narrator. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to uh, like, comment, and or subscribe if you did enjoy. And if you do, friends, I will send you a lung of your very own. It's uh, got some cigarette smoke in it, so you probably don't want to put it in, but it can be a good conversation piece, whatever you want. Anyways, I'll see you in the next one, friends. And until then, bye bye One, two... Three, four, goodbye, goodbye, see you again. Goodbye, goodbye, see you, my friends.